down to this, just like last season, the season finale, to see what's going to happen. Uh, except other than going up last year, we might go back down this year. This is Climbing the Ladder, our Football Manager 20 save. This is episode 24. I believe that's right, 24, with uh, our fifth club. And uh, so, yeah, we had a 2-2 draw, which was pretty pretty impressive uh, with AIK. We had two people sent off and still managed the draw. Uh, Jason Tarpe. Uh, two goals, a brace for us for the midfielder. So very good for him. Uh, they got a late goal from Sigidur Per Urbanchik in the 89th minute to equalize, costing us two points, which two men down. Steve Matthews played a 5-6. He had a horrible game. Horrible game. Uh, BK Hawken, we lost 3-1. Philip Lindbaum finally found the goal again. And Malmo, we managed to squeak a 2-2 draw. Uh, Karsten Bethke and Gel Selenius with goals spread on both sides of the first half. And uh, we actually led this one 2-0 and let it get away. And they were all on set pieces again, both goals on set pieces. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really hating set pieces. So we're back for Kalmar and Team TG. And this is what's on the line. Hammerby has clinched the league, the Alavinskan, this year. We are sitting in relegation in 14th position. We are even on points with Gothenburg, two goals back. That seven to one, seven to was it seven nothing? Seven to one, seven to one defeat is really looming large with that six goal differential. Otherwise, we'd be four goals ahead of Gothenburg at this time. Yeah, I am not uh, I'm not confident here, boys. Uh, Kalmar and Team TG. So Kalmar is in 10th, and Team TG is in 8th. So uh, not easy matches by any stretch. We've got to find a win. We have got to find a win. We, we can't. <laughs> I mean, we just cannot. Last five games, we're sitting 13th. Second half of the stage, we're sitting 14th with only seven points out of 13 matches. So that's going to get you relegated, <laughs> right? I mean, that's... Even at home, we're not winning anything. We're, we're next to last at home. We're actually better on the road. Go figure that. But, uh, all right, well, let's get into it. I did mention we lost our keeper last episode. He was sold. Uh, Matthew Dieter, I mentioned, he is out for the rest of the season with a broken foot, and he was our starting center back. And Jonas Osterberg is another backline player. He's still out for a couple of days. Well... We've beaten them once. We've beaten them once. We're on the road. We're pretty heavy underdogs. You know, I've I've tried these two tactics a little bit. I just don't. I'm going to go cautious. Minari, Matthews. Can I put Falk? I'm going to put Falk on the bench today. Oh, we did sign a new player. Uh, we did sign a new player. Forgot about that. We have signed, so we signed Martin Richardson. That was the uh, older goalkeeper. I think he's 36. You guys saw him last episode. We've signed Carl Evans. He's a 21 year old English midfielder. Four star current ability, five star potential. Very good physicals, very good mentals across the board, even with a touch of flair. First touch, dribbling, passing technique. Uh, he is well-rounded. He's played two matches. He's playing a 7.05. So he is now our starting uh, midfielder. And we are going to play him in the playmaker position. And Jacobson. Yeah. 
Can I get Badge on the bench? He's not homegrown, so I'd have to remove him for one of those guys. Davies is a center. You know what? 14 pat, 10 tackling. 10 marking. And only a 5 in marking. I was thinking about playing him at center back. I wonder if I could train him there. Let's let's give it a try. Let's put him there, see if he can learn it any better. Gives me another option. He can already play it, but he's not real good. But all right. Uh shit. Richardson. I think I've got to go with Gustafson in the goal. He's playing the best. Richardson, his last five. Well, he played a 7-3, but he did concede two goals. He has conceded at least two goals every match. Gustafson, 3-1-0-5. It's hard to tell, man. Hard to tell. <laughs> I don't know which one to, to go with. Cavalli's on the bench. Alonzo, Bash. Boy, I like both of those guys are playing well. Pedersen. He's in as a striker. I have. Can Davies actually play up top? Uh, he's got a two finishing. No, he can't. He's got pace. All right. Well, yep. Let's go with it. I, I could think myself to death. Oh, we have got to find a win. Come on, warm up. Uh, prove a point. I believe you've got what it takes. We're giving them the extra greenage today. We're playing cautious. We're actually handling. I'm going to go up to positive here in the early going. Unfortunately, they've got a highlight. Uh, Evans gets knocked off the ball. Hallen gets beat. Oh, perfect layback pass. Nobody closed down on him. That injury in our in our back line is is gonna, I think, ultimately be what cost us. It's probably a a talent thing too. Oh my God, Gustafson, fight for that ball! And then, oh Jesus, yes. All right, sorry, we're we're subbing you off right now. I I can't. I hate to blow a freaking keeper sub, but that was pathetic. And there's no way you were playing a 6-8. Uh, I don't think I've ever subbed a keeper off. But no, we, we, we can't. I mean, he just pussyfooted around with the ball. I'm going to go back to balance because we're just not competitive here. Just getting beat to the ball left, right, center doesn't even matter. All right, Evans gets there. Oh, God, Hallen just makes me ill. Lindbaum, good first touch into Selenius. Look outside, there's Bethke. He takes a blast at the goal. Keeper with a good save. Sets up a corner. We could really use... Demand more. All right, Lindbaum runs that one down. They're focused. Come on. Oh, another set piece. Oh, my God. Nothing. Pretty even match except for the screw ups. Tight 
Carface Furious. Hallen's playing a 6 8. I don't think so. Get creative. All right. Jacobson. Hallen makes up for that and puts one into the back of the net off of a set piece. We get one of our own. Nice job. Nice job. We'll give him some praise after that. All right. Um, boy, boy, boy. Tarpe is by far my best center back. And I don't have anybody else to play over there. I can move Min Minari in there. Nine, ten. You know what? I'm going to put Matthews in for Hallen. We'll bring Falk on and Ekstrom. We'll go all back line. All of our subs are blown with 25 minutes to play. We're going to go up to attacking. Show some passion. Oh, man. Daniel Borin, 12th goal of the season. 3-1 in the hole. Come on, boys. Push forward. We're on attacking. We're being outshot badly. We can't even hit our own players. All right, Lindbaum, nice ball out to Bethke. Bet he puts it into a player's leg. Oh, Gel Selenius gets near post. 14th goal of the season in the waning seconds. And we are not going to have enough time. Boy, that oh, that keeper gaff. I do. They they played a very good second half. Outside of that keeper gaff, that was how he played a six eight with that kind of screw up. I got no idea. All right, let's finish out the day and see what it looks like. Hammerby are crown the champions. Hallen's gonna miss the next game. And we are still even, minus three on points. Oh, and they have a game in hand. Oh, Christ. When do they play? The 29th. All right, well, we'll come back for our last game, which should be the day they're playing Kalmar. If they win... If they win, I, we're relegated because I don't think if they win, I don't think we could catch them on goal differential in the last game. And there's no way to catch Brahma Pajama. Oh my God. All right, guys. Well, we'll see you here in just a second. Well, I went ahead and came back a little early. Gothenburg loses to Malmo four to one which pulls us out of relegation by the skin of our teeth. That actually gets us even on goals. How huge is that freaking Hammerby ass-kicking at this point? Oh, my God. Is it, It's going to come down to this. What a nail-biter. All right, guys. Back in a second for the match. You know, I don't know what the odds of coming down to the last match of the season having this type of bearing two seasons in a row last year promoted final match of the season this one it's down to the wire boys we are dead even go to Berg plays Kalmar who are 10th we play Team TG, who are eighth. We have the advantage. Well, actually, no, we're, we're dead even. I, 
Uh, is that on wins? I have no idea. It might be sheerly on wins. So if we both draw, then we should still go up because the wins and the goals won't change if we both draw. Oh, man. I don't even want to play this game. I don't even... How did we do against them? We lost 2-1 to one last time we played them. We're at home. Oh, that's right. He is out. All right, Minari. He's going to come inside. He's actually not horrific. Nah, you know, that's not who I want there. I would like... Uh, I would prefer Matthews over there. All right, let's move him back out. Let's move Matthews in. So our right fullback is going to be Falk. Well, let's see if I... What about Minari? He's not bad. You know what? I'm going to risk it. Well, shit. 663. Ekstrom. I'm going to put Ekstrom there. I'm going to put Minari on this side. I like that. He's better as a central defender. We'll, just, we'll give him every advantage that we can. We're still going to leave Tarpe on cover. I would like... Can Evans play here? No. Can Badge... Let's see. Defensive... I'm going to play Badge over Jacobson. I'm going to change him to a deep-lying playmaker. I am going to change him to a box-to-box. -box. We've got wingers. We've got our strikers. Richardson in goal. Brought Bruins. Cavalli. Cavalli will be our up-top guy. Falk on the back line. Osterberg can be back line. We do not have any, any defensive centers, however. Howland suspended. Dieter's injured. None of those guys can play back. None of them. Uh, Gustafson brought Bruins. He's homegrown. Volley. That's what we're going to have to go with. I've got Karsten Badge on. I want to go with how because his he's been playing really well. I mean, you know, he hadn't had a seven, but he's playing a seven one six for the season. Jacobson's playing a seven oh eight. I mean, he's not playing horrible. An assist. Yeah. Let's go. God, I don't want to go down. You kind of have to get through that first year, get that chunk of money, and then get into that second year of transfers to really be able to build your team. And that's going to be the problem. How many players are we? I mean, I'm already looking at losing quite a few players. Come on, boys. Let's encourage them. Don't play around out there. All right, Bethke gets the ball. He's tackled. It's knocked away. All right, headed away. Good job. Evans brings it outside, lays it off. That was not a good pass to anybody. Oh, uh, pounced on by Selenius. He's in. Ugh. Come on, boys. Tarpe. That highlight falls apart. 
pulled in by Iverson. All right, Minari across to Tarpe. Building from the back, up to Badge. Good one touch up to Lawson. Larson. Uh, through ball, Lindbaum is there, and it bounces in. A lucky bounce. That's the 14th goal of the season. We're already on cautious. Oh, that was a brilliant run, a nice through pass. And uh, the bounce to end all bounces off the woodwork. Let's praise them. Last game of the season. They're going to play till their legs fall off unless I think it's a definite upgrade for them. Oh, my. Passionate. All right, just to keep them, keep them pumped up. And you calm, calm down. He seemed confused. I'm sorry. You were nervous. Don't be nervous. Come on, man. Ekstrom. Oh, Iverson again comes out and makes the flying save. Oh, what a good touch there. Ekstrom over the top. Oh, look at the one touch by Bethke. Evans plays it in. Larson, yes! Oh, my God. Ah, fifth goal of the season by Christian Larson. He has an assist and a goal to put us up 2-0. 51st minute. All right, let's tighten up. They're frustrated. I don't care. We're winning. Don't let them score. Everybody's doing all right. Oh, it went through. It made it through the defense, and Karsten Bash picks it up on the back post and puts it home. What a time for his first goal of the season. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, Evans is, is tired. Um... All right, I'm going to swap him and Badge. Praise. I don't even want to look at that other game score. Come on, boys. Play some defense. Oh, good, good clearance. Bethke challenges, knocks the ball away. Selenius, what a touch, and he's fouled. He, they're going to be sent off. There's a second yellow card. Indrason is gone. Praise him again. Oh, a 3 nothing win. What a time for our first win. And Kalmar looks like they won because they went up. We only allowed five shots. Maybe I should have been playing cautious all season, fellas. Oh, passionate. That was really special. That was. Wow. And we're staying up. Yes. Hassel Holmes into the playoff. They got a draw. Gothenburg lost. They have definitely been relegated along with Eskil Stuna. And what a time for us to pull three points out of our ass. So they were on 23 as well. All three of us were on 23 points. So we could have drawn and, and still made it out, it looks like, but... The win. Man, man, man. We avoid relegation on the final day. Oh, goodness. 
6-1 dismantling of Hocken. 4-1 win over Hassel Holmes. A 2-0 victory over Kalmar. We have a lot of guys make some, some scratch. What's that? 7, 9, 12, 13, about fourteen and a half thousand dollars Larson, one goal, one assist. Definitely player of the match for me. And we get $1.62 million. That helps the budget. We are just slightly over the payroll cap. Uh, Club Vision. On course, passed, pleased. So good year. I've got one year left on my deal. Yeah, they were disappointed. So was I, but, you know, that's what it is. All right, let's get to the end of season here and take a look at our season awards and whatnot. I'll be back for that momentarily. Well, that did not take long. Uh, let's see. Is this where the budget is done? I don't think so. Hallen inducted into the best 11. Well, I want him off my team. I think he's not very good. All right, let's see. Season review. Well, I'm, I'm going to say the match of the season was that last match of the season. Uh, let's see. Vision and expectations. All right, so work within the payroll. Fight bravely against relegation again. All right, so we'll accept that. Uh, calm. All right, well, you know, got a few people positive, a few people non-committed. Fair enough. Uh, end of season awards. Karsten Bash, 52% dominated, dominated. His passing skills, I think that's what, what made our season. What is that? Uh, dribbles made per game, over one. Shots on target, 80% passing, 93% tackles in the league. Uh, I think that's pretty solid. I think that's pretty solid. I am happy with that. Philip Lindbaum with the goal of the season, Ollie Jacobson, the signing of the season on a free, and the young player of the season, Karsten Baj. We will be back uh, in 11 weeks. I have a lot of off-season work to do, and uh, so I am recording this on Saturday, so that's what I'll be doing today while I'm watching the Leeds match a little bit later. West Brom and Nottingham Forest are tied at 1, uh, 50 minutes into the game. Kind of need West Brom to win to knock Forrest back a little bit or keep them from getting points. That uh, that budget helps us out immensely. Um, next season's payroll, 2.35. Really? We're in 2059 now. Says we're actually going down. 1.4. Now we do have... All right, we've got this young guy coming in. Okay, all of these guys are joining us here in the next month. So just a quick recap. We've got a young... Actually, he's leaving. No, he's leaving us. Okay. He's leaving us. He's leaving us. He's joining us. All right. He's not making that much to blow us up. Oh, well. All right, guys. Well, oh, what a season. Second season in a row, it went down to the wire with a nail biter. Final match of the season. That's huge. We stay up for another season, which is good because it means we'll make at least another $1.6 million next year. So budget-wise, we should be good. I don't know where it's getting this 2.35. We're already promoted, so there shouldn't be... 
there shouldn't be anybody getting promotion bonuses, right? I don't know. Anyway, have a good off season. We will see you guys to, to, you know next episode, which should be tomorrow, uh, unless this comes out on a Saturday, because uh, I do take Sunday off from uploads. But uh, anyway, I'm going to try to get through the off season today. You know that's going to take multiple hours. But we'll manage. We'll manage. Oh, by the way, in the comments, what do you guys think about the news that came out late yesterday about Man City getting booted out of the Champions League for two years? How many players are going to leave Man City? And does Pep Guardiola leave Man City? I think they gut their team. That's going to be harsh because... You know, you see in our, just in the game, you know, when you don't qualify, players players want to go. If you get relegated, players want to leave. Man, that's crazy. But that's, you know, be honest and don't lie. Don't cheat on your taxes. You know, that's <laughs> I guess that's the, the theme here. All right, guys. Well, hit, again, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Thank you so much for another great season. Uh, I had a well, if I said I had a good time, I'd be lying because this was a stressful as hell season. I had a good time last season, but uh, hopefully we can uh, build on that, improve our team a little bit, and uh, take that next step to at least be a solid mid-table team next year. That's that's my hope. But we'll we'll find out. I've got to make a lot of transfers. I need to see what the budget's going to be. I will get to work on that now. You guys enjoy the rest of your day or night or whenever you watch this, and we will see you next season. Have a good one. Bye.